Hey everyone, Justice Good here, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create this simple, fun to make colored stripes background. So, the first thing you want to do is create a new document. So, head over to File, New. And as for the width and resolution and height, you want to make it what your screen's background size is. So, of course, mine is 920 by 1200, but yours is going to be different. So if you don't know it, head over Google it, what is my screen resolution, or check in your system settings. Now once you have this new blank canvas, you want to make sure your colors are set to default. And you can do that by clicking the little black and white box above your color swatches. And to start, head over to Filter, Render, Clouds. Once you have your clouds, head over to Image, Adjustments, Levels. And drag the black slider to the right and the white slider to the left. This should pinch all your sliders together in the middle and create a really contrasted cloud look. That is going to help us keep some color when we go to our next step, Filter, Pixelate, Mosaic. Now I'm going to use a cell size of 50, but understand that the higher your cell size, the bigger your stripes. So once you're happy with that, head over and click OK. And to make the stripes, we'll head over to Filter, Blur, Motion Blur. Make sure your angle is set to 90, which is straight up, and your distance at about 600 pixels. Of course, you can adjust any of these settings to get your own custom result. But this is what I used. Once you have your stripes, we're going to head over to Filter, Lens Correction. And under the Custom tab, you should see the third box down says vignette. We're going to darken that all the way. This is just an additional step to make these shadows a little bit darker in the corners. That is an optional step. Now head over to layer, new fill layer, gradient fill. And under this drop down menu, you can right click and select through any of these gradients. I'm going to use the classic spectrum, which is what you see this used a lot with. So we're going to use the solid colored one and as for the angle we're going to make it horizontal which is a zero degree angle. And if you want to adjust the scale, the higher the scale the more spread out the gradient gets and the lower the less spread out. So we're just going to use a scale of about 115. Make sure you have dither checked to increase the quality of the gradient. So once you're happy with that, you just click the blend mode of that layer and set it to overlay. And there you have your colored striped background. Of course, you can tweak these settings to be whatever you want. So let's say you want the gradient to be straight up, you turn the angle to be 90 degrees instead of zero. Also, if you don't like that gradient, you can go ahead and pick any of the gradients that Photoshop gives you or even make your custom one. So I'm just going to go ahead and look through some of these just to show you some of the different effects you can make. As you can see, Photoshop has tons of presets. You can also edit it and make your own. So I'm going to stick with this here, orange, magenta, and teal gradient. There you go. There's how to create the colored striped background, and you can tweak it in any way you want. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.